Hello, I'm Joseph Albert, Editor-in-Chief of the American Journal of Medicine, and I'm here today to call your attention to what I think is one of the most interesting article, articles in this month's issue. Um, it's from China. Um, the first author is Qin, but that's Q-I-N, uh, not C-H-I-N. Um, and um, it has to do with a randomized, blinded study of acupuncture for low back pain. I think everybody who lives on this planet has had an experience with low back pain. It is universal. It's because we walk upright instead of like our cats and dogs on all four. In any case, a lot of times low back pain is uh, incapacitating, puts people out of work and causes a lot of misery. Um, some people uh, get addicted to narcotics because of persistent back pain. It's, it's a really big health problem. Well, the Chinese randomized real acupuncture against a sham, fake acupuncture. And in fact, it was helpful um, that the acupuncture group, when they broke the code, were really being benefited uh, by acupuncture. And when I have patients who've tried a whole bunch of things, the pain pills and so forth for whatever form of pain and, and it hasn't worked, I often recommend go try acupuncture. It can't hurt, it's inexpensive and the side effects are absolutely minimal. Sometimes it helps, sometimes it doesn't. Okay, if it didn't help, you have gotta move on to something else. But it's certainly worth trying and this study is one of many that has supported the use of acupuncture for the relief of pain.